Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Brentford versus Everton. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Luca Digne plays with Seamus Coleman in the fullback positions. Alan starts alongside Abdoulaye Dukure in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Committed challenge. Onyeka. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. One nil then. Alan on the ball, Richarlison, Ducure. Well, the timing was perfect, ball one. Frank Onyeka. Here's Nurgard. Now, what can they do from here? I'm looking towards the back post. Well, the keeper wasn't fooled by it at all, in actual fact. Gray. Coleman. An alert intervention. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And he read it really well. Fine save. And now the delivery, not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Gray. Look at Dinia. And on the ball, Keane. Alan. Yeri Mina. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Getting in there to take it away. On Yeka. Can't argue with that little move. Cross could be useful. So almost at half time, and they are making good use of home advantage. Still a bit of work to do, though. Stuart, your thoughts on what you've seen? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent but any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. Sounds in. Calvert-Lewin. On the ball, Richarlison. Ducouré. And cleared away. He's beaten his man. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break.
Well, the hosts, as you can see, haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Let's see about the delivery. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Something to worry about here. Good looking ball. Has eyes for goal. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Now sending it in. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And there it is, the half-time whistle. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Ivan Toni, Onyeka. Here's Nurgard. Can't miss, surely. What a block. Richarlison. Alan. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Who's going to get on the end of it? It might be Townsend. On the ball, Richarlison. Shot attempted, and the keeper getting across to stop it. Playing it short. Alan. Gomsch. On the ball, Richarlison. Ducouré. Calvert Lewin. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Janert. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Ducouré. Well, as you can see, Everton have had most of the ball, but they've shown a real lack of invention today. One or two of their more talented players need to step up now to get them back into this game. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Ducouré. Really getting stuck in. Bermo. And space for the cross. Deciding to go inside. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Ducouré. 
on the ball Andros Townsend surely well last gas defending but brilliant defending just 15 minutes remaining and what can they do to stop him running at them and the referee sees that as a foul free kick given Personnel change then. Played in there. Taking care of business defensively here. Dangerous looking attack. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Keen. and now Dominic Carbert-Lewin and the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack Townsend a terrific defending to stop them progressing Frank Onyeka promising looking attack Delivered into the area here. Defended well. Well, three minutes of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Look at Dinia. Richarlison. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.